So when you think of top-notch wrestling teams, you might not automatically think of young women. Those preconceptions are changing in the Wayne Westland School District where some wrestlers are grappling their way to statewide success. Paula Tutman takes us to Wayne Memorial High School, home of the Zebras, to find out what all the buzz is about. There's something going on in the Wayne Westland School District. Dare I say, a dynasty in the making? An incredibly young pool of talent creating a deep well of prospects and hope for the future of, of all things, girls wrestling. Ready, you wanna do some drills? This is the very definition of being ladylike. Very aggressive, very good, Mariah, excellent. At two schools in the Wayne Westland School District, John Glenn High School and Wayne Memorial, women's wrestling is growing because of some outrageously talented young women showing incredible promise. Watching them come in not knowing anything, not knowing what a pin is, anything along those lines, to having them um, progress so rapidly. No stranger to wrestling success, John Glenn's sophomore, Nikayla Dawson, scored the title of MHSAA Girls Wrestling State Champion for the second year in a row. Minutes away at Wayne Memorial, this has been a first year of an organized program. For 15-year-old ninth grader Mariah Simpson, her coach says the magic is in the hips and how she defies momentum by being able to turn on a dime. She has this inherent strength and this innate ability. The way she uses um, her hips when she's wrestling, it's intuitive. It's almost very difficult to teach how quickly she adapted to it. So I understand the whole entire move, but the only problem was that I wasn't putting my hip into it. The small thing made a big difference. So it was hard to get that person down. But once I start putting my hip into it, I was able to get them down. These are freshmen, smart, hungry for success, fearless. Mariah just went to the state championships last weekend after only a season of wrestling. 14-year-old Stephania Sanchez Juarez, also a freshman, got one match away from the championships. When you looked at it, mm -hmm. did you think, oh, definitely. When I started off, I was not very confident. I was slow. I was, but you know, it's always hard work. Hard work is the very big thing that can get you anywhere, no matter what you want to do. And there are four other girls in the program who show sheer grit and talent. And did you remember that I mentioned that these young ladies are only freshmen? Watch out sophomore, junior, and senior years. Paula Tutman, Local 4. Put your hip into it, right? Thanks, Paula. Girls' wrestling season is over, but because of the success of their first-year program, the coach says she's already eyeing additional talent to join the team next year. We'll let you know.